In cases means hospitals are filling up and while you may be getting COVID fatigue, there's one group with a big burnout that can't slow down. That's right. News Channel Line's Nicole Somavilla introduces us, introduces us to two nurses who say this is the hardest thing they've ever done in their careers. Most nurses here are doing 12-hour um, shifts. Jackie so and Ruthie seven, work in one of the COVID units at St. Joseph's Hospital and 10 months into the pandemic, it's not any easier. It physically and mentally, um, it's emotionally exhausting. You're pretty much nonstop working from the time you step on the unit till the time you leave the unit to take all your gear off again. Head to toe in gowns, gear and shields. Some days they don't even have time to step away for water. And with the staff spread between separate COVID units, they're relying on one another like never before. Not only are we isolated working on these units, but patients are, are very isolated as well. Nurses are now caregivers, trying to be there for their patients the way their family members physically can't. It's heartbreaking and exhausting, and there's no finish line in sight. Just because we're sick of it doesn't mean it goes away and doesn't mean it's over. We signed up for this and we are here for the patients. Showing up for their patients, hoping the community will be there for them. Please wear your mask, wash your hands, socially distance. Nicole Somavilla, News Channel 9. We're going to hear more from them tomorrow night on News Channel 9. Nicole talks to Jackie and Ruthie about what's different in these COVID units now compared to the spring.